friends, for today's phonics activity, we're going to actually review the last three letter sounds that we've worked on. And those letters are J, Q, V. Now let's see if you guys can remember the sounds that each of these letters make. What sound does the J make? Excellent. J, J, J. What sound does a Q make? Perfect. And then what sound does the V make? Yes. So first I'm going to need your help sorting out these pictures I have by the beginning sounds that they make. So my first picture is a violin, jacket, jam, question mark, queen, van. I need your help deciding what letter these pictures begin with. Let's start with queen. Qu -qu queen. Does queen start with a j? J, Q, V. Q, perfect. Next we have a van. Does van begin with J, J Q, Q, V? Yes, V. What about jacket? Does J, jacket start with J, J? Q or V? J, J. Excellent. Next is violin. Which letter does violin begin with? The V. What about jam? J, jam. Excellent. J, J. And then her last picture is a question mark. What letter does question mark start with? Q. Perfect. Now let's practice drawing some more things that begin with these letter sounds. Go ahead and get a piece of paper out and write these three letters at the top of your page and grab something to color or draw with. Again, we're working with the letter J, Q, and V. And those sounds are J, Q, V. So let's start with the J. We know that J jacket and J jam begin with J J. Let's think of something else. I got one. J J jellyfish. So let's first work on a J jellyfish. So a jellyfish has a dome top and then kind of a little squiggly bottom half. Just like that. And then we need some little wiggles here. Perfect. Oh, let's give them a couple eyes. One, two. Cute. J, J, jellyfish begins with J, J. Now let's work on the letter Q, and Q says Q. Now we already know that Q, queen and Q, question mark begin with Q, Q. What's something else? Oh, I got it. It's really a sound. A duck says quack, quack. So I'm going to draw a duck. Let's see. For the duck, let's start with the head. We're going to do a little round head here with a little neck. Oh, almost looks like a qu question mark. And then I'm going to do a hump for the back half. And then I'm going to come back to the front and finish off that neck. Next, I'm going to curve and bring it around. And I'm going to stop right there because I want to be sure I have room to make my tail feathers. So I'm going to come back around over here and just do a little spike, spike. Perfect. Now I'm going to draw the wing. So I'm going to come inside the middle of the, towards the front of the deck. And I'm going to swoop back and do a couple more little spiky spikies. There's the wing, and then we need the beak, so I'm going to come back to the head, and I'm going to make a cone shape, coming out and back, cone or a triangle. 
And now I'm going to make a little circle for the eye. And there's our duck, and ducks say quack. I'm going to write quack. Q-U-A-C-K. Quack. And our last letter is V, and we know V says Z. Now we've already reviewed that a van and a violin both begin with a V with something else. I got a good one. Let's draw a volcano. So a volcano is kind of like a mountain, except it erupts and hot lava comes out. So let's start making the mountain shape. Start at the bottom, kind of swivel up, make a flat top, and then swivel back down. Excellent. Now we're going to make it look a little rough and bumpy because it is a mountain. And then next we're going to make it erupt. Stress some steam and ash coming from the top. And we can't forget the lava. So I'm going to just hook it around like that. Perfect. There's our volcano. So let's review. J says J like jellyfish. Q says Qu like quack. And V says V like volcano. Good job, friends.